IELTS Life Skills A1 Spells Visa Test. Ready? Yes. Okay, let's start. Moolpreet candidate A, Rimsha candidate B. Let's start over. This is IELTS Life Skills A1 Speaking and Listening Test. My name's Angelina. Candidate A, what's your full name? My full name is Amol Putkar, and my candidate number is 1234, and I'm here for IELTS A1 skill, life skill, speaking and listening test. Beautiful. I asked not to mark attendance, okay? This marking attendance happens before the test. Before the test begins, it happens. I am just asking your name from you. That is all. My name is Amol Putkar. Okay, all right. So let's okay. start. Let's start. Rabia is B and Molpreet A. You ready? Okay, mom. Okay, this is IELTS Life Skills A1 speaking and listening test. My name's Angelina, Canada A. What's your full name? My full name is Anmol Pitkar. What can I call you? You can call me Anmol. Can you spell your name for me? Yes, of course. A N M O L. Where do you come from? Basically, I am from Patala. It's a big city. Okay. Tell me about your favorite things you like to do when you go out with people. Uh, when I go to out with people, mm. I like to do a uh, playing game with them and uh, share my opinions with them. Okay, all right, all right. And how do you get information? Always I like to get information from internet as well as people. Uh, although I like to get information from books. Hmm. Are you wearing your headphones or you have removed them? I wear them. Okay, fantastic. Okay, my last question to you is what kind of music do you like? I like sad music. Whenever I listen to this type of music, I feel relaxed. Thank you. Thank you so much, candidate A. Candidate B, what's your full name? My full name is Rabia Fahid. What can I call you? You call me, uh, you can call me Rabia. Can you spell your name? Yes, please. R-A-B-B-I-A-F-A-H-E-D. Where do you come from? I am come from uh, Sialkot, Pakistan. And what do you do? Uh, I am housewife. What do you do in wet weather? Um, mostly we stay at home and uh, sometimes we go in park and uh, near a nice restaurant and eat out. Tell me about a special day in your life. Uh, my wedding is uh, my special day of my life because... Uh, this is very uh, nice and memorable day for me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. And how do you celebrate your favorite festival? Uh, 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 we get up early in the morning and we make nice food, mm -hmm. uh, like different foods. And we wear a new dress, uh, jewelry uh, and shoes. And we uh, spend time with all family. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much, candidate B. Now, first candidate A will question candidate B about doing new things. And candidate uh, B will question candidate A about favorite singer. Favorite singer. Okay. 
So first candidate table question candidate B about doing new things. You only have two minutes and your time begins now. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, do you like to do new things? Yes, I like new things. Which type of things do you like? I like uh, uh, handicraft and uh, uh, and new dresses. From there, you learn about new things. Uh, what you say, sorry? From there, do you like to learn about new things? Uh, I uh, learn uh, on YouTube and uh, uh, Google. Okay. Uh, yes. When do you like to do new things? Um, mostly uh, in free time, I learn. Okay. Uh, this type of things do you use for new things? Uh, what do you say, sorry? This type of things do you use for make this type of handcraft? Uh, I like um, like uh, cross stitch design and uh, cross stitch uh, uh, wall pictures, and uh, I like uh, rug uh, nice. Uh, and uh, I know how to make because I learn on uh, YouTube. And uh, I know how to make dress, so different uh, like knitting and everything I like. Okay, who appreciate you about these things? Do you uh, do it? Nice question. Uh, uh, my all family uh, appreciate me uh, for this and uh, my husband as well. He appreciate me uh, on my work. Okay, do you like to uh, open your own studio of these things? Like uh, you want to show to everyone that in your city, in your country? Uh, please, uh, you say again because your voice is very like... Uh... It's not very uh, crisp. It's not very clear, I believe. Yes. It is there. Yeah. Yes. Okay, one second. Hello? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hello? Yes, uh, yes, we can hear you now. Yes, uh, I said again, do you like to show your talent to people, to your city and to your country? About yes, I like. Yes, I like uh, the uh, the same peoples. They they make uh, like a show uh, like art gallery uh, and uh, nice like make uh, knitting and uh, make stitching like stitching and everything like fashion. Uh, okay. I like. Can I get? Can I tell you guys the easiest questions that you can ask when it comes to doing new things? Like asking a person, "Do you like doing new things? How often do you do new things? With who do you do new things? Do you like to do new things when you travel, when you meet people, when you invite people at home on your birthday or on weekends? Do you like to do new things on your favorite festival or when you go to your favorite restaurant? Um, and you may also ask that. What do you like about doing new things and very easy questions in case you cannot make up anything. At least you can ask questions about questions that are related to the topic, okay? Like doing new things. Do you like to do new things on your birthday, on your favorite time of the day, your favorite time of the year, Excuse when you me, travel? This type, of, this yeah? type of things we can say about new things. Do you like to do new things with... Uh, your husband, your best friend, your neighbor. No, no, no. Yes. I'm talking about which type of things we can say. About. I like this. I don't understand. Repeat yourself. I mean to say that which type of things we can say. I like to do this new thing. Thing? Like anything. Like what, what, 
Do you like to do new things when you go to a restaurant? Yes, I like to try a new recipe maybe or I try a new cuisine okay or try a new okay, okay. Uh, do you like to do new things on your birthday yes I like to wear a new dress on my birthday right do you like to do new things when you meet people yes sometimes we because when you meet new people you try different activities you know uh, when you invite people at home maybe there's there's some kind of new food new activity new gossip something but there is okay. something going on uh like doing new things do you like to do new things with your family yes we always want to try something new either it's going to a restaurant visiting a shopping mall trying a new sport with family or talking about an interesting topic i think everybody tries to do something new i think so. okay so uh this topic was not very nice i want you guys to discuss it again you guys have um Two minutes and your time begins now. Okay, now start over. Just two minutes. Your time begins now. Do you like to do new things? Yes, I like to do new things. With whom do you like to do things? Uh, I like uh, uh, I like with my husband. Okay. Uh, do you like to do new things while traveling? Yes, I like to do uh, new things while traveling. Uh, while traveling. Which type of things do you like to do while traveling? Uh, I like uh, to uh, like uh, go on new places and uh, uh, I like art gallery and sometimes I go museum and found new things there. And uh, read the history. This is new for me. And uh, I uh, I uh, go some shops and uh, visit uh, visit some shops and uh, try new dresses, new shoes. Okay. When you go to a restaurant, what do you like to do new thing over there? Uh, I I uh, I uh, try new recipe on a new restaurant, and uh, have like uh, last time uh, I uh, try lemon chicken is very nice. Okay, when do you like to do new things? Uh, when I go with my husband, and uh, sometimes I go with my sister in law. Um, then uh, I do okay can you tell me about your good experience about do new thing yes uh my all is good experience when i go for shopping and uh, i found a new dress and very nice dress for my birthday and one time i found uh for eid uh, eid uh, dress and a uh, nice jewelry dress and everything like matching. Uh, I have very good experience for uh, dresses shopping and like all shopping. Okay. Do you like uh? Do you like to do new things with the other people, with strangers? Uh, no, uh, I don't do. Uh, I just uh, share with my friends and my family. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Thank you so much, candidate A, for your questions. Now, candidate B, please ask your questions about favorite singer. You only have two minutes and your time begins now. Okay. Do you have any favorite singer? Of course, there are many singers, but my favorite singer is Duljit Dasanj. Uh, what kind of singer uh, he is? He is a Punjabi industry singer, but now he likes to sing uh, Hollywood songs. And when you listen to uh, these songs? Uh, mostly while traveling and uh, whenever I do household chores. I like to uh, listen his songs. How to listen uh, the song on TV, on phone, 
weird sometimes uh, i listen to songs from tv but most of the time i wearing headphones because i like to listen his voice uh do you think uh, this voice is very nice and of course his voice is very melodious and whenever i listen to his songs i feel very relaxed and uh, uh, my stress is almost mount and do you have any favorite song on this uh, like uh, this singer have yes. any favorite song yes his song is peaches and uh, this song related to girls and her looking and uh, her way of talking and i always it's my repetitive song and how much time do you listen this favorite song uh you can't imagine i listen this song 100 times in the day and uh, with whom do you like to listen your favorite like, uh, your favorite singer i like to listen his songs with my husband sometime uh, with my friends and uh, do you listen uh, in car of course uh, while traveling uh, we uh, we play his songs in car and enjoy uh do you listen in uh, at uh, do you listen at home uh, like uh, for birthday party or some thing other? yes uh, when we celebrate any festival and any birthday party any anniversary we of course we play his songs and we dance together okay uh, you like this uh, favorite uh, you, your favorite singer you know your family have any other person uh, the like same singer yes of course my husband also like to him and uh, i i remember that uh, he dance with me on my wedding day on on my favorite singer song thank you now candidate a and candidate b please discuss with each other the topic weather you have 3 minutes only and your time begins now okay what kind of weather uh, where you live uh mostly here is cloudy and rainy and okay. what kind of weather uh, in your area uh to be honest i live in india it's a hot country but in this uh october to feb february it's a cold weather okay and what you do in a uh, cold weather uh i mostly in cold weather i like to stay at home and uh, i like to eat uh, uh, like uh, crack like fritters with tea and uh, i like to take coffee and what like to do in this type of weather where you live uh mostly like here is rainy so not uh, stay all time at home sometimes we go park sometimes we go shopping and everything we do uh, but uh, mostly we are, are going on uh, uh, weekend uh, some uh, like and uh, nice places like park and seaside and uh, mountain side okay uh, do you like hot weather no i don't like hot weather why you don't like hot weather because uh, i have allergy uh, sun allergy so i am not going out in uh, like sun weather uh, i wish all time like rainy weather and have same here okay yes what kind of food do you like to eat in cold weather uh i like uh, to eat uh, like curry and uh, samosa and uh, 
uh, I like to drink tea. Okay. Which type of clothes do you like to wear in cold weather? Uh, I like to wear a long coat, long uh, shirt, and a warm trouser. Okay. And uh... what do you eat in uh, warm weather? Oh, sorry, cold weather. Yeah, I like to eat uh, pranthas in famous in my city. As well as I like to take tea two to three times in the day. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you. Thank you so much. Three minutes are over. Congratulations. You did a very, very good job. So much. Okay. Number one thing, I give you guys a lot of time to talk. Examiners are extremely strict about timing. They have to finish, wrap up your test within 22 minutes. Okay? Within 22 minutes, the test is over. Now it is time to move to the listening test. And... Um, Let's try it. All right. Can you see the screen? Yes. Yes. Okay. So let's talk about it. Who is speaking in the first recording Canada Day? A tour guide, a TV presenter, or a radio presenter? Candidate B, who is talking in the second recording? A tour guide, a TV presenter, or a radio presenter? Let's listen to the recording now. Hope you've enjoyed the trip so far. It... IELTS Life Skills B1 Listening Test Recording 1 Now it's competition time. It's for young people. So, if you want to present your own show, here's what you do. Write in to me and write a hundred words about what you would put on your show. There'll be five winners and each one will take over a 15-minute slot on this radio program for one day of the week. More details on the prize later. I look forward to receiving your emails. Recording 2 Hello. Can I have your attention, everyone? Hope you've enjoyed the trip so far. It's coming up to 9.30. So you'll have three hours to look round before getting back on the coach at 12.30 for the short drive to Exeter. Please don't be late getting back on the coach or we won't have enough time to look around Exeter. Now, for the castle, there's an admission charge of £4 for adults, half price for children. The best way of... Hmm. Candidate A, from the first recording, who is speaking, a tour guide, a TV presenter, or a radio presenter? A TV presenter. TV presenter is talking? Why did he say radio? I'm not no, sure. No, no. Okay, he's I'm talking not sure. about the show. I'm not really sure about it, because it's a radio presenter means that they... Anyone else can help? Who is speaking in the first recording, a tour guide? A TV presenter or a radio presenter? A radio presenter. Mm -hmm. Okay. And candidate B, who is talking in the second recording? A tour guide, a TV presenter or a radio presenter? A tour guide. Thank you. Now, listen again and answer these questions. Candidate B, from the first recording, how many words to write and how many minutes slot is available for the winner? Candidate A, from the second recording, how much time do they have to look around? And what is the charge for castle admission? Are you ready to listen? Yes. IELTS Life Skills B1 Listening Test Recording 1 Now it's competition time. It's for young people. So, if you want to present your own show, here's what you do. Write in to me and write a hundred words about what you would put on your show. There'll be five winners, and each one will take over a 15-minute slot on this radio program for one day of the week. More details on the prize later. I look forward to receiving your emails. Recording 2 Hello. Can I have your attention, everyone? Hope you've enjoyed the trip so far. 
It's coming up to 9.30, so you'll have three hours to look round before getting back on the coach at 12.30 for the short drive to Exeter. Please don't be late getting back on the coach, or we won't have enough time to look around Exeter. Now, for the castle, there's an admission charge of £4 for adults, half price for children. The best way of learning English... Alright, candidate B, from the first recording, how many words to write? A hundred words. And how many minutes slot is available for the winner? Fifty minutes. Mm hmm. Not fifty. Uh, fifty is a lot. Fifteen minutes. Fifteen. Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes. Please make sure that you know the difference between fifty and fifteen. Okay. Okay. Uh. Uh. Yes. Uh, so, candidate A, from the second recording, how many? How much time do they have to look around? Three hours. Okay, and what is the admission charge for the castle? Four pounds for adults and half for children. Children, thank you. Thank you so much. You both have passed your speaking and listening test.